Hi guys, welcome to Angels of the Earth Tarot. This is a manifestation reading for Gemini. It is general, as usual, so just take what resonates for you, leave the rest behind. It won't all resonate for you, with it being general. If you'd like a personal reading, or if you'd like the extended reading, to take this reading a little further at the end of it, um, you can also use the email in the description box below this video requesting the extended video or a personal reading and I will send you the link. Thank you to all of you who subscribe and like our videos. This helps me to continue bringing these videos to you free. So I do appreciate that very much. So I'll get straight into your reading guys. We have five of earth. This suggests um, a lot of concern on your part. Some of you perhaps have had to move home you, or you feel lost, you feel alone, feel abandoned. It could be a physical, you know, where you've had to leave someone as well, or someone has left you. Yeah, definitely. You've got the chariot, so there's been some movement. I do feel some of you are going to have to move. This could be affecting your manifesting, all this movement, that things are not stable within your life at the moment. And with the King of Water here, it feels that it's really affected your heart somewhat. Um, King of Water is, is someone who is very kind and very sensitive. Um, I do feel though that you will get control of this and that this move, those of you if you are moving or um, if it's a physical move, then you will, you will get a hold of it at some point. It's just at the moment you're, you're feeling, it's a cold energy, you're feeling a little desperate or a little just alone, just alone. Yeah, we have the seven of air. So your energy here is, is a negative energy that's surrounding you at the moment. Um, I could feel with the seven of air that there's been some deception going on around you and this is preventing your manifestations from coming into being at the moment because your, your energy is not good you're sitting in this negative energy here and when we're like that we can't we're not seeing things clearly so a move is going to be needed uh, this this or a change a change is going to be needed this will be coming towards you the universe is bringing this towards you this move or this change in your life Yeah, here we go. So it's a good ending, guys. We've got two kings here, and this king of earth is ending the reading for you, which shows that you will be getting you will be getting control of your life back again. So if this is concerning money or housing or something which is, you know, a lack of something, lack of abundance in some way, um, or lack of stability in some way in your life, there's definite moves here forward, movement forward for you. So just keep manifesting, what you, doing what you're doing, except try and remove yourself out of this seven of air energy here, which is negative. I know it's a struggle. Just get a couple of cards to clarify it a little bit more. So this is just this is just backing up the eight of swords here. The eight of swords is telling you here that you are holding you possibly for some of you are holding yourself bound in this energy here. That there's not a, a need to, that if you wanted to remove yourself from this energy you could, but you're allowing this negative energy to get you down and keep you here. But at the moment if you were to manifest and, and change your energy, then you would be moving out and get getting control of, of your situation. So it's all about the power of your mind, guys. The power of your mind. This is not the power of physical strength. This is the power of your mind. You're holding yourself fast. Yeah, look. Queen of Wands. If you change your mindset now and change your energy and choose to do that, you will regain your confidence, the confidence of the Queen of Wands, and you will stand up and you will be you you'll be the King of Earth again. I mean, Queen of Wands and King of Earth, that energy is is wonderful stuff. 
So it's time to work on your mind now. You're, you're only bound in this energy now and it's stopping your manifestations from, from moving forward with the chariot because it's your mindset. So it's time to change your mindset. Okay, guys. Now we'll look at how you could do that in the extended video. So if you'd like to um, receive that, um, just email me, guys. And we can do that. Otherwise, thank you for joining us and we'll see you again on your next reading. So bye for now.